Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and this is already, I already know who this is, it's Bantu Batty, and all these churches in my Going so fast, hope I don't, okay. Okay. Let me stop, but anyway, let me, let, let's, let's get this intro really, you know, like, what's, what's the word, okay? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. You already know who it is. It's your girl, Bantu. What? Baddie, if you if you want to be bad, join a crew, join a gang. You already know. Like, you know, we got a bunch of C. Subscribe. You can sit up the front. Like, comment, share, you know? And today, you guys really liked it. The, um, what is it called? Red flag. The first red, the first red flag video I did. So I was just like, shorty, uh, come back with part two. Okay, we about to get all snooky and a sugar and a monkey and a sunny and a gungy and a rungy and a money and a honey. I don't even know what I'm saying. But yeah, I have some. I made a list. <laughs> it ain't that long though. It ain't that long though. But we gonna go through the list. Okay, that's what I got in my head. And I'm probably might gonna be popping in and out with it. Okay. So let's go to my list. So the first one is a zodiac sign, bro. The first one is a zodiac sign, bro. And let me tell you, y'all probably like, bitch, what? You know, not not a zodiac sign. Like, no, it's when he uses his zodiac. It's when he uses his zodiac sign as an excuse. Like, you know, he could be like, you know, texting you late, or he could be acting different and stuff, or moody and shit. You know, when he like, you know, he just comes to you without, I don't know, with the little attitude or whatever, you know. And he'd be like this. You already know I'm a Virgo, you know, a crazy or whatever. You know, they'd be like, you know, I'm, you know, I'm a Virgo, so you know, like, this, 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 what happens, you know? Like every time he blames shit on his zodiac sign, leave that man, cause like. I don't believe in that stuff, so therefore, you know, like, believe what you want to believe, but that's, that right there, it's not going to cut it, you know? So don't come to me and being like, you know, I'm in areas, you know? So this is the type of shit we do, you know? I'm sorry, man. You can't, I, what is it called? You can't blame me because, you know, this is some shit that areas do, you know? So stop fucking using your zodiac sign as an excuse. Just own up to the shit, my nigga, like... Ugh, that's not uh i don't like that like stop blaming shit on like you know like zodiac signs and stuff like that just admit to your fucking wrong period never that serious you know okay <laughs> the next one the next red flag is i think a whole lot of people can agree with me on this it's a fucking truck driver like fuck to the no like i can't speak to a truck driver to be honest i don't know if I do an interview, you don't say none. <laughs> it's funny. I will never speak. Like, no, I don't want to speak to no truck, like, truck driver. And it's not me, like, talking down at their job or whatever. You know, it's cool. Run up y'all shit. I know y'all be making stacks and shit like that. But that shit not for me. And plus, you know, I have, like, a whole lot of trust issues and shit. But we talking about the players, okay? So some of y'all truck driver could slide. And some of y'all, ah, ah, ah. You know, but, like. Truck drivers, to me, is just a big-ass red flag because these niggas be on games, yo. They be on games. Every city that they about to pull up to, just know it's a shorty that they texting like, Hey, I'm in your city, and your ass at home slump. He in another big city, about to get turned, about to get what? About to get work out type shit, you know? Like, he out there up live. Like, he out there up at night. Like, my nigga, you just been driving for, like, how long? And you out here want to chill? My nigga, go get some sleep. You gotta drive tomorrow. You know, like put your ass to sleep. You got you gotta work tomorrow type shit. So a truck driver is just a big ass red flag for me. Sorry. Don't come for me in the comment. I'm just this is my shit, alright? <laughs> okay. The another one is Oh my god, my piercing about to come off. The other Okay, no. The another red flag is I've never been with a black girl before. Like, my nigga, am I a fucking science experience? Like, what the fuck? Like, that's so unattractive. Like, you don't have, like, you don't hear me saying, like, bro, I've never been with the Chinese guy before. I've never been with the Mexican guy before. I've never been with the Arab guy. But, you know, like, I don't know. Like, they just be like, <sighs> I've never been, like, why are you bringing that shit up in a conversation now? Like, you just made the shit so fucking weird and awkward. Like, like now it makes it feel like you're fucking using me like bitch am i your motherfucking slave type shit you know 
but I don't like when a guy say that like why can I not just be a girl to you like the fuck like why can we just not talk like why you gotta mention I've never been with like what the fuck like are you trying to be with all type of fucking races at this point you know like it's either you think I'm cute or keep it fucking moving like why is you put in I've never talked to a black girl before you know like like what the fuck <sighs> nah I ain't your fucking science experience don't experience here next type of shit you know I don't like that though. Okay, when a man say a lie he too much, that's a red flag. Don't believe that man. Don't believe that man. Don't believe that man. Cause you are here just like maybe say well lie you ain't gonna go. Like we gonna be free. We gonna be here together forever. They say well lie you ain't gonna cheat on me. His ass just like <laughs> he's like this dumb. You know he's like yeah I'm gonna say well I ain't well I ain't gonna cheat on you. Well, I ain't gonna go nowhere. Don't believe that stuff. I don't like it's like stuff or like that's wrong and stuff like that. Like I don't understand why people abuse that word, but like I don't know. In a relationship, don't even say that word. To be honest, I don't think I don't know. It's either you trust that person, you don't trust him, then just keep it moving. Don't even deal with that situation. Make sure you have full trust in this nigga, or like don't be with that man because like well i he i don't know i don't think they understand the freaking meaning of it but that's very disrespectful you know so the next one is if he has a female friend because like right now it's just like what i said right now like what like what is you having a female friend for my nigga like why is you having a female friend for like dead ass like why do you have a female friend like, I'm your best friend, you know? Like, you're having a long day. You want to talk to somebody. You got a big secret. You tell, big secret? You fucking tell me. What, you, what is you telling your best friend for, huh? Because now, because now, because now, because now you got me feeling some type of way, you know? Because, like, she's probably just like, damn, her nigga don't even come up to her and, and express his feelings. He don't be even tell her half the shit. Like, you know, like, bitches be on that type of mindset. And you're not going to be having me looking dumb and goofy around bitches, you know? So, therefore, you ain't going to have no best friend. Because if you want to talk about anything, you talk to me about it. You don't need no different shorty, you know? Yeah, that's how I just feel about it. Like, fuck that friend, best friend shit and all that shit. Like, why is she commenting on your stuff? Why is she swiping up? Why is she swiping up? <laughs> okay. Anyway, next. If. What I said, if he has a female friend. We already spoke about that. Okay, if he's. It's another red flag is if he's friends with half of the females, you're friends with on social media. Cause like what the fudge what the fudge <laughs> like what the fudge like why is you following her you my man you are here following her so you you trying to make me look goofy in front of these females that's what you're trying to say like why the hell is you following her you know <sighs> i don't like that i don't like a man that everybody fucking knows man i like my nigga low key <coughs> yo low key okay and another one is when he's underneath every female comment yo that shit mad fucking embarrassing like if your man does that leave that man because bitches out here looking at you weird and dumb like i don't like that they're like oh you talk to him he used to be underneath my comments and shit i don't like a friend i don't like a friendly ass nigga i don't like that shit oh yeah and that's another thing too a friendly ass man like why is you being friendly you got me looking dumb <laughs> you know like why is he so sweet to these females like i don't want you to be like mad and rude it's just like you know like shorty want to come to you and say what's up you just be like say what's up to my shorty she want to say well, what how are you doing say how you doing to my shorty like you don't know, talk to me talk to me talk to me why is you speaking to him and why is he speaking to you why are you not telling her to speak to me? Speak to me. <laughs> okay. Another one is if he. Mm, huh? I already said that. Okay. If he don't admit to like he's wrong. Baby. 
that's a little boy behavior like if you cannot admit to like where you went wrong my man my guy mm, i can't talk to you because like you know, a relationship is all about communication and I'm going to admit where I'm like where I'm wrong and where I'm coming from. And I'm going to need you to understand like where you went wrong and also where you coming from. You know, you can't just be out here talking all this shit and just blaming shit on me. Like my nigga, like admit to your fucking wrong type shit. You know, like if a man doesn't admit to his wrong, cut off, don't know, cut off. So another one is... Another one is when he always trying to link in the motherfucking night. Like, why is you linking that? Why is you linking with me in the middle of the night? You know? I'm not sure saying. If he link with you in the middle of the night, shorty is a done no. Like, this nigga living double life. <laughs> I don't know. Like, why is you linking up me in the night? Like, you know, like, we got a full day. You know, like, the sun and everything. Like, you don't want to go outside with me. You don't want to go outside when, like, you know, look at the sun up. Like, damn, we always in this dark-ass place, you damn. And then another one is just kind of the same thing. It's like, when he calls you in the middle of the night, like, boy, I am not your booty call. Like, because you're calling me at the middle of the night for, you know? I don't like that shit. Like, when niggas be hitting your phone up at the middle of the night, like, where's your fucking shorty at? <laughs> like, where's your girl? Because, like, what the hell is you doing? Like, why is you calling me in the middle of the night? Why is you calling me in the middle of the night? Why is you calling me in the middle of the night? Okay, and then another one is a man that tries so hard to get you. And once they get you, it's like all that shit, all that stuff that they was doing, hopping on you, chasing you, sucking your, you know? Like that shit just go away. Like what the, like what happened to that? Like, you know, I like when you were crazy about me. Now you're not really crazy about me. I don't like you, you know? I don't know. I just feel as though like once a man gets you, they just you know like they don't they don't want to play that game no more. <laughs> like what? I'm up for the fucking game, you know? Like chase me. I'll chase you back. Like let's let's chase each other, you know? Like be crazy about me. I'll be crazy about you. Yeah. What is that called? Yo, somebody should comment that too and I still freaking forgot the two couples, man. But anyway, yeah, that's the ending of the video. I hope you guys like, subscribe, and comment below. And you guys, I saw another channel that I love you guys. I love you guys. So make sure you guys subscribe, like, comment below. And yeah, I already know your girl, Banty Betty, is in love with y'all. And I have a lot of nice, exciting news for you guys. But inshallah, we'll just wait until the time happens. And I also want to talk about other things. Like, you know, like, I don't know. Let's, we're going to talk about this in like a whole another video. But you already know what I'm going to say. If let your mama know, let your bald head granny know, let your ex know, let your boyfriend know, let your husband know, let that crackhead in behind, behind the trash. I'm just playing. <laughs> that crackhead know. Let your um cat, your dog, your grandma, everybody know to subscribe to my channel and join the motherfucking king. You know, we trying to get lit and trying to get turned. I gotta turn up. Mm. But thank you guys. Mm.